<clears throat> what? There are a couple of comfortable. Kapo <laughs> kapo. <laughs> Welcome back to another episode of Home Invasion Season 2 with Pepper Fred. So today I am standing outside the house of Yasmin Karachiwala and as you know, know that she is Bollywood's go-to Pilates instructor. I have heard that her house is as slick as she is, so I am very excited to check it out. Are you guys ready? Let's go! Good. It shut by itself. Of course it will. Come. Of course this is your house. <laughs> I feel like I walked into like a hotel suite. You're very nice. Thank you. Very, very nice. Shall we sit somewhere? Where should we sit? There's so much space. Should we sit here? We can sit there also. Actually, let's sit on the dining table. On the dining table we yeah. should sit. This is why your dining table exists. I have to tell you, this is definitely one of the most modern houses I've seen in Bombay. So how do you even start designing a space like that? Kafi detailing. Uh, you know, I really, really like open spaces. Mm -hmm. And if you look around, like there are pieces, but everything is really open, yeah. comfortable. I like colors and I like to play with them. My interior designer has worked with me for a really long time. He knows I like it open. Like now my boys are teenagers but they still come and lounge on the sofas, put their feet up and I allow them to do everything because it's a home, right? And they should be comfortable and yeah, here. And the pieces I pick up uh, when and as I like them, uh, you'll see pieces like that in the house, even like the frame, uh, my painting. And you don't want to put it like exactly. just for the Exactly, when I saw this, it was like, okay, I like the mystery around it, I like something about it. And it really stands out, I love it. So yeah. when you're designing a space like this, are you the only person making all the decisions? So it's really funny when you ask that because when I actually went to pick up the sofas, uh, my husband was busy hmm. and he was like, you go choose it. And I was like, yes, it was my opportunity to buy white. My husband cannot believe I put white sofas in the house. Because I'm sure it's yeah. hard to maintain. And I've always wanted white sofas. And when the sofas came and they were white, he just didn't know what to say, but it was too late because they came from Italy. <laughs> and they look wonderful. It's fitted yeah. wonderfully into yeah. a very comfortable and open house. Yeah. I love it. It was quite bold having two boys and the third one being my husband to put white sofas. Someone's got to do it and of it's course working. it's working. Yeah. <laughs> but if you had to tell me in one word, what is your overall vibe of this house? What would that be? So I designed the house, right? Mm. And I know what my vibe is. Let me ask you what you think the vibe is. <laughs> ah, my God, this is backfired. No, I think the vibe is very open. It's very contemporary and I like it's very clean. Like yeah, it's contemporary yeah. and comfortable very, and very nice. that's what I dig. Okay, so do you have a special spot in this beautiful house? The first one's my bedroom. Would you like to see it? Of course. Is it this one? No, actually it's downstairs. You have it downstairs? Yes, my just Okay, let's go downstairs. Okay, come on. <laughs> So this is where I spend a lot of my time in my bedroom. We only actually go up when we're entertaining. That's the bedroom. That is amazing. And also these stairs are crazy. <laughs> no, my kids used to run down these stairs. Maybe I should come to them for some lessons then. Never. <laughs> this is one of my favorite spots in the house. I can see why it is beautiful. I really love the setup. Henna, it's from Pepper Fry. And I also really like your room, yeah. It's so like nice vibe. I love to chill in my room. Tom kittai matlab chill. I'm pretty sure your version of chilling is, I don't know, like planking or something. This is how you live <laughs> in your room. Okay, but seriously though, where do you work out in your house? Actually, I work out on the terrace. Do you wanna see? Absolutely. Should we go see? Will you work out with me? I don't I don't think I can. I thought you were gonna say, yeah, yeah, I will and all. What is this laziness? Come on, let's go see what I can make you do. I love the view from my entire house. Let me show you the terrace. Very excited to see terraces in Bombay. Arriva, this is really nice, yeah? Thank you. Do you have lots of like New Year party plans here? Yeah, we always do something on New Year's and every Saturday my friends just come over to hang as well. Of so. course, if this is your terrace, will they not? 
So this is actually very, very nostalgic for me because I started my journey, the second phase of my journey from my terrace. I had converted this area into a little studio wow. uh, when I felt like my living room was bursting with people and uh, this was my goal. This was like my dream to have this gym on my terrace and I converted it and I used to have people coming and working out and it was a very, very cool vibe. And then I started getting more and more people and the place was suddenly again bursting and we had to move and now I have this really swanky studio. This place is like, you know, every time I sit here I think of that studio and how I started my journey. So it's very nostalgic. And look how far you've come. It's fab. So I love that, I know that you love working out. So I actually do have a very fun challenge for you. Are you ready? I'm ready. Are you? It means it's not for me. This is for you. Okay, and for you. I. Just, yeah, we are doing a challenge. Let's go. <laughs> Come on. Shallow, shallow, shallow. We'll go. Okay, here we are. What is this? This is a trampoline. Have you ever been on a trampoline? I've never been on a trampoline. Okay, let me just hold your hand. Step okay. up carefully. And then I'm going to step up and just bounce. Okay, this is not... Yeah, and when you feel comfortable, you jump. So are you ready for some I'm would ready. you rather questions? Wow! Would you rather never sweat while working out or never feel sore after a workout? Never sweat. Would you rather have a huge balcony in a tiny apartment or a huge apartment but with no balcony? Hmm, difficult. Huge apartment with no balcony. Bombay, you got to. Okay, would you rather have strong arms and weak legs or strong legs and weak arms? Very difficult to answer your questions because you're asking me things I have all of. Of course, but, you are uh, the perfect 10, Yasmin. <laughs> no, no. Uh, strong legs, weak arms. Strong legs, weak arms. Oh, interesting. Okay, would you rather delete Instagram or delete Netflix? Instagram. Really? Yeah. I love Netflix. Would you rather never stay in on a Friday night or never leave the bed on a Friday night? Uh, never stay in on a Friday night. Are you a party person? Totally. Lovely. Okay, would you rather be able to talk to animals or read people's minds? Read people's minds. Obviously. Would you rather eat one bite of food having maximum nutrition or one plate of food having minimum nutrition? One bite. Health is first. Okay, would you rather always talk in rhymes or sign instead of speak? Sign. Really? Yeah. Okay. Would you rather never have breakfast again or never work out again? I think I know the answer. Because you don't eat breakfast. Never have breakfast again. I have a last one. Would you rather never have chocolate again or never have ice cream again? Ice cream. Okay, and with that I'm done. <laughs> Okay, this is it for another episode of Home Invasion Season 2 with Pepper Fry. I feel like this is going to go on for a while. So, okay, bye. Did you have fun, Yasmin? Bye, guys. I had a blast. Hey, guys. I hope you enjoyed the tour through my house. You saw that I've picked up some amazing pieces from Pepper Fry. So, do check them out for your shopping needs. Happy furniture to you and be fit because you deserve it. <laughs>